watching San Diego's breaking news leader. This is CBS News 8 at 5. To set someone on fire, he doesn't have any enemies. He doesn't make, make people angry or anything. Julio's not like that. A terrifying attack in an Oak Park shopping center today as a man set another man on fire. Thanks for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. And I'm Steve Price. Police say a man lured the victim to his truck, doused him with a flammable liquid, and then set him on fire. This happened around noon near a Rite Aid in the 1700 block of Pentecost Way. The man was taken to UCSD Medical Center's burn unit. CBS News 8's Heather Hope is live in Oak Park tonight with more on the attack and the search for the suspect. Heather? And witnesses say they were appalled as they watched that man set another on fire. And investigators are out here right now laying out some evidence markers. And again, witnesses say they believe that man was a transient who did not know the suspect, said he was a total stranger who did the horrible act. The heat was so intense, I couldn't even believe it. Like nothing she'd ever seen, Misty Cardenas says a man she didn't know approached her and her friend Julio outside an Oak Park Rite Aid with a red cup asking for water. But when the two said they did not have any, the man retaliated. He asked, asked me and him to come to the truck, and I stepped forward, but the facial expression wasn't right, and I got a bad feeling, and so I stopped. But Julio kept going, and right when he got to the truck, it was almost immediately head to toe in flames. The suspect threw flammable liquid on Julio and set him on fire. I ran towards him, but the, the heat was so intense, and the flames were so high and so wide and just so hot. Julio screamed as Misty rushed for help. I was just screaming for people to call 911, and the man, he just stood there and watched him burn. And then he just nonchalantly got in his truck, drove away like nothing happened. The suspect sped off in a 1980s black Toyota Tacoma. Witnesses say Julio got out of his clothes and ran as his skin was covered in flames. He was burnt up, completely burnt, so. His skin, he was just standing like this and his skin was hanging off. Paramedics found Julio in the 1700 block of Pentecost. Crews rushed him to the UCSD Medical Center burn unit, where he held his hands over his head in severe pain as much of his skin burned off. On the scene, multiple officers of San Diego Police Department arrived with yellow tape surrounding the parking lot and a red canister on the ground next to clothing and a Hello Kitty children's book. Misty says she just wants justice for her friend. All of his eyebrows and his eyelashes and everything were gone and he had tears in his eyes and he just told me, Misty, please make sure that they get him. Police say they are investigating this attack as a homicide, and while that victim is still alive, they said his survival is not likely. So if you have any information on that suspect, police are saying he's a Hispanic male in his 30s or 40s, about six feet tall, driving that black Toyota Tacoma with the white strip on the passenger side. You're asked to call police and new at 630. Why the transit community here is saying this was a targeted attack. I'll send it back to you. All right, Heather.